my friend and welcome to my channel. Today I've got another Moonshine Manny nail polish. This one's She's Not For Shim. And I'm going to stamp it with some blue. Started off with Nailtix Formula 2. And here is She's Not For Shim. Rachim. <laughs> and this one was a little thick for me. Um, not un non unworkable. And I would rather a polish be a little thick than too thin. Um, but I might end up adding some thinner to my bottle just to thin it down just a little bit. It's got some chunky stuff in it, so it does, you know, look a little bit textured on the nail. It's not textured, but it's kind of got that look. That's the first coat, and we're going to go in with the second coat. And this just has so much prettiness going on in it. It's just such a beautiful polish. It reminded me a little bit of the Essie one I just used. Viva Antigua, but this one is definitely different, but it's got that behind shimmer thing going on. Here's my manicure with just the polish, and I'm going to be stamping today using BP, I think it's 105, and this Nicole Diary in S06, and my monocle stamper and my Fabernil scraper. turned around and I'm just applying a little bit of the polish right here to my image that I'm wanting to use it's kind of an abstract optical illusion looking image and I didn't like that one so we're gonna give that another go there we go I think I was scraping too hard beautiful pickup though I'm gonna put this on my ring finger Loving it. Cleaning that plate off in between. We're going to do this again. Awesome pickup. And we're going to put this one on the middle finger. And ooh, don't you hate it when that happens? Look at that. What a mess. I couldn't get it off with tape, so we're going to use a little bit of my nail polish remover and just wipe it off, real light touch on it, and since I had put a good top coat on, I was able to do that. So we're going to try this one again. There we go, nice pickup again, and hopefully this one will work. Yes. Yay. I'm going to do this image. This one's going to go on my ring finger, my middle finger, and my thumb. So this one's going on the thumb. Excellent transfer. And this one did not come up with tape, so I'm going to go to Smurfville, and um, I have to. I'm doing some of the bigger cleanup with the Q-tip before I go in with my cleanup brush. And I'm telling you, this blue, and I knew it would. It's it's a it's not a stainer stainer because after I got through cleaning up and washed my hands, it, there wasn't any blue left, but it, it definitely was a mess. It's just getting into all those little crunchy, crusty spots around my finger. <laughs> That's okay. That's, it, it'll work out. It'll be all right. After a couple of hand washings, it's totally gone. been a minute since y'all have had to watch me clean up with the cleanup brush so or at least do any extensive cleanup with the cleanup brush this is pretty extensive this is normally what I'm trying to avoid when I use the little tape trick I'm trying to get in there real good and tight get it all cleaned up so there we go we're going to live with that cleanup for now. I'm going to top this manicure off with Posh Top Coat. And it's a little blurry. There we go. Oh, wait a minute. The camera's not, not liking this one. Between the lighting and the colors, it's just having a lot of trouble picking up. There we go. No, we don't. Yes, we are. Oh, it's like one of those teasers. I love how this looks with the glossy top coat on it. So 
there we go orangewood stick sorry for my my smurfed out little fingers but that's it guys I hope you like this one leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think and as always thank you for watching and until next time be good to yourself I'll talk to you soon bye